Hi all, welcome to the new episode of Tech Insert. We are going to make a 12 volt or 9 volt power bank for router or DSL modem or fiber modem or even ADSL modem etc. We are making power bank using 18650 battery. This is an emergency power bank. That is why I am not adding the charging part in this circuit. We are connecting two 18650 lithium ion battery in series by attaching two single cell 18650 battery holder. Thus a total of 7.4 volt is used for this purpose. Using two batteries will give you more than 1 hour and 10 minutes backup. I have tested this at my home. If you want more backup then you can connect more battery holders in parallel to increase the current that is ampere hour. I have not packed this in a case. According to your aesthetic sense you can pack this inside a plastic box or a paper carton box etc. Circuit diagram is not needed for this one because only three parts or components are used for this one. One is battery holder, then a buck booster and a mail connection jack. This is XL6009 buck booster. This will work perfectly on 3 ampere load. For smooth operation you need to add a heat sink on this part. Apply a small amount of thermal paste here and attach a heat sink on it. This module will boost the voltage of 7.4 volt that is from the battery to 12 volt or 9 volt which is used by the modem or the router. I will add the buying link of everything in the description box and I recommend that you buy these from your local market. In local market you will get these in cheap price. If not available then only go for online buying. Let us continue assembling this. Peculiarity of a booster module is, if the input voltage is less than fixed level, then module will boost the voltage to that particular level. And if the input voltage is higher than the fixed level, then whatever is the input that will reach at the output. That is why booster module requires a regulated power supply for its operation. Kindly do not forget to click the like button and also share to your friends.
let's check the heat sink the heat sink is not even warming the coldness in it has gone that's it we can expect a very high backup in this modem the backup time of this power bank depends upon the current consumption of the modem you can check the backup by looking into the voltmeter if you believe that this power bank will be very useful to you then please subscribe to my channel please click like button and also share to your friends this is tech insert signing off see you in another video till then goodbye and please take care